Good day to you ladies and gentlemen, this is a remake because in the last episode, well, basically when I tried to record this for the first time, I noticed that I got my ass kicked and the gym leader was so hard that he immediately one hit KO'd my Pidgey, plus he killed all my other Pokemon so I was wiped out. I think this is way too early to give up yet, so I just restarted, <coughs> well, I, did, I didn't really restart, but I just did some off-screen training now. And now let's take on the gym leader. Uh, I will try and get my Pidgey to evolve because he evolves at such a late level, being 18. I'm going to turn up the sound a little bit because it is quite quiet, I guess. Now let's do some battling. Don't you dare brush me off. It's not my fault if you cry. Well, looks like we've got quite the self-confident young lady here. With the Meditites and stuff for fuck. Oh my god, protecting yourself. That's so low. So lame. Fuck you. Okay, you're dead. Why well, you lost indeed. And I didn't cry, so you don't have to apologize. Now I'm going to take a look. I'm going to switch my po Oh, okay, it is already good. I mean, my, my mum was already up front, or, or he, he was like my second Pokemon. But there is a double battle coming up here. And let's quickly beat them both. Meditite and Machop. I'm going to gust the Machop, and I'm going to lick the Meditites. Which is going to do quite a good deal of damage. For fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, let's just try and do this shit. Why did the did my moves not hit you? Okay, now they did. Fuck, okay, sorry, my, my commentary is kind of bad. Today I am recording this on Tuesday, the 15th of May, and my birthday is almost coming up. Uh, May 19th? Well, yeah, well, I am recording this earlier. Well, I mean, I'm going to have uploaded this, of course, after my birthday. Sorry, I didn't think about that. It's Saturday. Uh, well, yeah, I'm going to put an annotation in that in my video and stuff. But yeah, now I'm level 18, so I should evolve into Pidge uh, Pidgeotto. Let's take a look. HM Airline has now evolved into Pidgeotto. Woohoo! Okay, are his stats much better now? I'm quite curious. Quite a good physical attack, physical defense as well. Yeah, it's quite good. Although, my mom still has the highest attack. And then my Rapidash, of course, has even higher one. But I don't really care. Now, let's go onwards, fight some more... People! She will crush me apparently, well I'm gonna pause the video and crush her instead. And I do not one hit KO uh, any of these uh, of these Pokemon, so I have quite the problem right now. Because I thought that making my uh, Pidgey evolve would basically solve every problem, but apparently it does not solve anything because I still don't one hit KO the Pokemon. That's kind of stupid kind of a downer well I don't really care now let's go onwards but first I will go to the Pokemon Center and now uh, I've basically found a sort of like rule I'm going to stick to uh, I'm basically going to try and uh, speed up all of it all the parts inside like here in the in the Poke Center and stuff and in the gyms I'm going to speed the, those parts up because then I don't get the frame rate issues but when I am outside I'm, I'm going to try and avoid speeding up the video because it's kind of annoying and stuff Another trainer, might is right, come on. No, might is not right. And you're wrong, because you're gonna die. Mwaha. Goodbye. And I'm level 19, I do, not I do not learn a new move. Not enough power, I guess so. Now, let's go to the gym leader. Uh, so, yeah. First, I'm gonna split the recording into two, because I'm already at quite far, so be right back. Hello there, and I have been a stupid dickhead. Let's just put it like that. Uh, basically what happened uh, I just said that I would basically split the recording into two pieces and I and I had done that and I and I battled the gym leader I won and stuff I recorded all that but then I, I decided to split it into another piece and record a new part and stuff and then I call it accidentally the same name as I named this part which resulted in this part completely disappearing out of my computer so now I only have the first third I guess and the last third of the video and the middle third one where I battled the gym leader and did some other stuff is gone I can't get it back I tried everything um, so yeah that's a really huge disappointment for you guys this is a really important moment I'm just a stupid dickhead and now I've learned an important lesson that I need I need to pay attention because I, I just put in some random letters and stuff like emerald one two and stuff and I accidentally I accidentally said emerald two 
for the third part instead of the... Uh, well, it's just quite complicated, but I just lost the middle video file. So I'm going to try and briefly cover this. And then, of course, I'm going to put the last the last part of my Let's Play thing. Uh, I'm going to put that in the episode as well. So, now I, I beat this trainer. What happened is I just got my Pidgeotto out and got him to basically one-hit KO all, or, all his Pokemon. It wasn't really that much of a challenge. And then... I can see your talent becoming a giant wave to cause a storm of astonishment among trainers one day. So he's quite impressed, and then nothing else really happened. He just gave me the TM bulk up, which is like a bad TM. And then I went outside, I talked to this guy. What? Turn too bright in here. Your future is bright too, so he's also quite impressed. And then I decided to go to this guy, Mr. Briny, who basically offered me to... Oh yeah, he offered me to bring me to Slateport City, which is like the next town. And then, I, if you guys maybe remember, uh, someone gave me Devon Goods, which I had to give to a guy here. And I still haven't done that, by the way. I still have the Devon Goods, so you didn't really miss that much. But yeah, you will see it later on. And then I battled some trainers in here, quite boring and stuff. I'm at, I mean, I, I just skipped the battle scenes, but still, you missed me exploring this beach. Then I went inside, I fought these three trainers, and I got six soda pops, which apparently you can buy here as well for $300, overpriced piece of shit. Okay, sorry. And uh, then I went over here, and then the first building I went into was this one. I talked to the scientist type of guy, and he, he basically said that, oh, you, you, you shouldn't give those goods to me, you should give them to Captain Stern, but he is not here right now. Uh, so I need to find him. Haven't found him yet, by the way. And there was a queue here full of, like, Team Aqua members. And when I went outside from that building, uh, where I just exited from, it, I mean, the, the, the queue was gone, and now this place is flooded with Team Aqua members. But still, that's for later on. That's not for now, of course. You will see that in the, in the second part. But, ugh, fucking hell, this is so hard. And then I... This is so hard to redo, I guess. And then I went to the Pokemon fan club. I went inside... And I talked to this guy, and he didn't even give anything, he just did some explaining about what a contest is. And then, I am now here. So, now now comes the actual Let's Play part. I really apologize. Alright, let's go back outside, and I'm not gonna speed up the video. There is a huge line of these Team Aqua members, can I go inside? Hey there, quit pushing! This is the line, can't you see? Alright, alright, I'll go all the way to the back of the queue. Why are we even lining up and paying? We should just march in! <laughs> are you just gonna pay? Oh my god, that's pathetic. Hey, you there, don't butt in! What? What do you want? You want to read this sign? I'll read it for you. Let's see. Um, I think it says something like, The life in the sea is endless. Yep, I'm pretty sure that's what it says. How can you not be sure? I mean, you can read it. What the fuck? Okay. Did, did you even pass primary school? I mean, that could explain why you're so fucking retarded. Now let's take a look, is there anything else to do here? Um, if this goes here and that goes over there, then where does this where does this, ugh, this thing go? And what about that doohickey? Ugh, I can't make heads or tails of this. Hi, I'm Doc. Captain Stern, oh, I, need, I need to find Captain Stern probably. Uh, commission me to design a ferry. Oh, that there, are they Devon goods? But, hmm, this won't do. Captain Stern went off somewhere. He said he had some work to do. Could I get, could, could I get you to find Captain Stern and deliver that to him? Sure you can. I mean, everybody, everybody just demands stuff off of me. Where the water is clean, the, the fruits of bountiful harvest gather. And where people gather, a market soon starts. All right, all right. And now the people are gone, but first I'm going to take a look whether I can catch a new Pokemon on a new route. Actually, two Pokemon, because I mean, I can also fish in here. Let's take a look. Old Rod. Pokemon, Pokemon, show up, show up. Fuck you. Pokemon, 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 show up, show up. Fuck you. Another place. Pokemon, show up! For fuck's sake! Ah, oh, okay, so apparently there are Pokemon here. I just need to be a bit faster. Okay, Pokemon is on the hook. Fine. Oh my god, it is a Lance, yes! Are you shitting me? He's just gonna kill himself as well. Or no, I just. Oh, okay, that, that's a failure. All these Latioses and Latiasses, that's not really fun. Well, in here, Rat 110, what is this? A Totodile? Okay then. That is good enough. I mean, I'll try and catch him, but I probably won't really succeed. Hmm, let's take a look. Which move could I still do to weaken him? Maybe my psychopath knows a move to put him to sleep. Oh, yes, he does. 
Okay, that's good. And now let's start throwing some Pokeballs at him. I'll just start with the regular Pokeballs. Oh, for fuck's sake. I mean, he is a starter Pokemon and all, so he's going to be quite hard to catch. Oh, for fuck's sake. Although, to having Totodon on the team, I will have a second Pedo Crunch. That'll be awesome. Come on, don't, don't jump out of my fucking Pokeball. I want you to travel along. Oh, yes, I got a, I got a Totodon. That's awesome. Okay, despite its small body, Totodile's jaws are very powerful. While it may think it is just playfully nipping, it bites. It bite has enough uh, strength to cause serious injury. I will give a nickname and screw the rule. I'm going to uh, use all the old names from, from my previous Nuzlocke challenge. I'm just going to call him Pedo Crunch. If you guys know who Pedo Crunch is, you should. Otherwise, I would recommend you to watch my Pokemon Liquid Crystal Let's Play. Pedo Crunch, alright, he's placed in the box, I'm definitely going to play with him, although I already have a really good team, so it's kind of a tough choice. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use him when one of my other Pokemon die, of course. And basically, um, a new rule for me, because um, I am able to use Pokemon and stuff, and, and when a Pokemon dies, I can just use, use the second one from the PC, but uh, I'm going to make it a rule that if I completely white out, and, and my, team, my entire team faints and I have to go back to the Pokemon Center, that is where I draw the line. Then even if I still have Pokemon, I'm going to ask you guys whether you guys want me to continue with those Pokemon or not. Because uh, it is just so much of a humiliation to get your entire team being uh, wiped out by a gym leader or something or, or the league. Then I'm not really sure whether I want to play with all the other Pokemon in the thing. Because it's just such, such, it's just so humiliating. And I think that, that I should draw the line there and that should be the end of the Let's Play in my opinion. Alright, well, let's take a look. Uh, I I'm not really sure whether I should already go onwards or not. You know what? I'm not gonna do it. Fuck that shit. Well, it's actually a shame, really. Totodile. I, I, I mean, I already have a good water Pokemon and stuff, so yeah. <laughs> well, I'm going to uh, save the game now and end the episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'm sorry that I basically have not really done... Uh, that my commentaries are sort of lacking lately and that, b that results in bad videos. I'm going to try and fix that, but I'm quite stressed out with my exams and stuff, and my voice is not 100%, although it was quite decent right now, but now my voice is already starting to disappear, I can't really shout that loudly anymore. Well, anyways, thank you for watching and goodbye.